Today, let's talk about dairy detox. Have you ever wondered why we are the only species that still drink milk as adults? Have you considered cutting dairy out of your diet but the belief that dairy is essential to our health has held you back? Detoxing can be a very good way for you to experience the benefits of reducing or withdrawing a certain ingredient from your diet. And there is huge health impact of dairy in our health. So, what is a dairy detox? A dairy detox is when you completely remove dairy from your diet. Some people do it for two weeks but the best results should be noticed if you do it for 30 days. That's because a 30-day detox will allow your body to eliminate toxins. Dairy products are filled with growth hormones and antibiotics, that is injected in the cows so they keep producing milk and to avoid them getting infections. Because of that, it will of course be absorbed into the milk that we drink. That can affect us by leading us into antibiotics resistance in the long run as well as the dangers of developing diseases due to the hormones found in the milk. Among other things, dairy can increase our levels of IGF-1 which our body produces. IGF-1 is a growth hormone and has tremendous benefits in our health like building muscle, decreasing mental health issues, helps to fight diabetes, and boosts growth and development. But it also comes with really bad side effects such as developing cancer and decreasing your lifespan by half. Fun fact, 70% of the world has some degree of lactose intolerance. Removing dairy from your diet during detox is extremely beneficial to your body. It can lead to clearer skin, especially help improving skin conditions like acne. You will notice a better digestive system after cutting off dairy products. Believe it or not, it'll also lead to weight loss. Because milk raises insulin levels, it might be easier to lose weight without dairy in your menu. What else, it will prevent you from milk allergies and decrease your risk of cancer. That's not all. Did you know that women get double the risk to develop ovarian cancer if they consume more than one glass of milk a day? And that men get a 34% increase in developing prostatic cancer when they consume two portions of dairy a day? By now, don't you get more determined to do a dairy detox? To make the detox process more effective, there are a few more foods you should avoid during a dairy detox, or detox in general. The worst foods to have during detox are wheat, meat, alcohol, caffeine. And of course, dairy. Why? As mentioned, dairy is acid towards our body which affects our cells function and that will massively decrease the process of detox. As for meat, it slows down our digestive system and helps bacteria to grow and breed in our gut. Sounds pretty bad, doesn't it? Wheat is harmful to our intestines lining which decreases our ability to intake nutrients, also not to mention that wheat irritates our gut which leads to bloating, constipation, and ingestion. Coffee leads to an increase of toxins in our body, and alcohol is harmful to our liver and will jeopardize our detoxification. Also, processed foods, too much salt or sugar should be avoided and removed during a detox. Keep in mind that during a dairy detox, or detox in general, the best foods to have are vegetables, fruits, nuts, seeds, and whole grains, as well as omega-3 fishes such as mackerel, salmon, and sardines. Besides, drinking plenty of water is essential during a detox, so you should keep yourself hydrated at all times. Not only because water is crucial for your health, but water accelerates the detox. What are the withdrawal symptoms of a diary detox? Although the symptoms of a detox are never a pleasant feeling, you should know that for most people the symptoms will subside in about a week. Let's remember that most of us have been consuming those types of food for a very long time. So, it might be a challenge to remove it from your diet at the beginning. But what to expect from a detox? Here are some of the effects and withdrawal symptoms during a detox, 1. Lots and lots of cravings, especially for things like cheese and creamy dessert 2. Moody and irritability 3. Change of sleeping patterns 4. Hunger bang This is related to craving. The best way to deal with it is to get yourself distracted and being away from food. 5. Stomach issues Your digestive system will react to any type of detox. So, be prepared to irregular bathroom trips. 
If after the detox you wish to start to consume dairy and anything else that you have excluded from your diet, you should reintroduce them into your diet slowly, so your digestive system has time to process it. There are so many diary replacements you are reached to such as coconut milk, almond milk, soy milk. In the next video, I will talk about different type of plant-based milk in details, helping you to choose the best fit for your diet. Stay tuned. If you like this video, please don't hesitate to give it a thumb up. And don't forget to subscribe to this channel if you would like to get notified when a new video is on. See you next time.